Once it was announced months ago, the Smashing Machine, Steve McKinnon in the white shorts, taking on the AK-47, Chris Bradford, making a return to the ring. Five by three minute rounds, K1 rules. Hang on to your seats, folks. Well, the more experienced of the two, Steve McKinnon, of course, seven-time world champion. I'm pretty sure some of those are in different weight classes as well. But um, a lot more experienced. Chris Bradford, of course, a little bit rusty, maybe. He hasn't been in the ring for a little while. But this is the moment of truth here, really, for Chris Bradford, because if he can take this on and, and have a big victory here with McKinnon, he will make a big statement at this stage of his career. Both boys at 40 years of age, looking fantastic, am I lad? Yeah, a testament to both fighters, really, at 40 years of age. Have a look at the physique and the fitness of these two fighters. Kidden trying to go upstairs, high round kick, but counter punches from the AK-47. This main event brought to you by Flavors Fruit and Veg and Clark Rocker Accountants. We hope you're enjoying the stream on combatsports.com. Power Play 37. trying to find an opening. Chris just sitting back. Chris, Chris so far, composed, relaxed. You know, checking those shots. Got his hands up nice and high at this point. Yeah, Giving well. a bit of a nod here to McKenna saying, hey, I ain't worried. Did nice, well nice. The low kicks. Nice. I want to see Chris take, I want to see him open up a little bit. I want to see him open up that arsenal. I want to see what he's got to offer here tonight. So far, he's very defensive, covering well, catching everything, pretty much most of everything. Well, I have to say, probably a little bit of ring rust for uh, uh, Bradford? Chris Bradford. Yeah. Sorry, Steve McKinnon had a win uh, over Joe Bouvier uh, a couple of power play shows ago. So obviously still active, whereas uh, Chris Bradford probably three, four years out of the yeah, ring. Look, sure. Yeah. And again, I mean, look, I said, uh, He's not executing, he's throwing a lot at the moment, but his, his defense is exceptional at this point. And so round Chris one, very heavy by five. Second round of round two. five. Main event, power play 37. Chris Bradford, the AK-47. Stuart, sorry, Steve, the smashing machine, McKinnon. I tell you what, John, I tell you what, I, I, I think that one round in the bank for Chris Bradford will do him good. He would, uh, he would take that any time. And, and look, he's actually got a bit more confidence and he's maybe opening up right now. Yeah, he'd be very happy to tuck that round away. Keenan going upstairs with a high round kick once again. He's actually, he's actually looking like he's enjoying this, Chris Bradford, which is a good thing. <laughs> Well, he's smiling hey, at uh, It is what it is. You, you know, you pick the fight, you're in there. It is what it is. The outcome will be what it will be, but just enjoy it. Both boys worked hard here in preparation. This Nice kick to the body there by McKinnon. He's got to throw punches here. He's got to throw punches. Chris now on the front foot, starting to unload. Nice, nice, above us. nice, nice, nice. The Both boys trading. From McKinnon. McKinnon, oh, big right oh. hand by Bradford. Bradford coming on now, McKinnon. McKinnon with his back on the ropes. Nice uppercut, oh. left hook. Bradford opening up that arsenal here. Chris Bradford here. Right above us here in the commentary position stand. Bradford unloaded some huge bombs. Nice pickup check there by Chris Bradford. 
Why he's looking for that uppercut, I tell you. Nice knee attempt there by McKinnon. Nice low kick, right hand. Both boys trading, big shots. Good strong ground kick from McKinnon. Nice, nice invasive move there by Chris Bradford. Hey, remember, both these boys are 40 years of age. Hey, bit of a smile there between both boys. Nice check there by Bradford. This is the happiest I've seen Bradford ever fight. Hey, I've commented a oh, yeah. lot of his fights. So once again, he backs McKinnon into this neutral corner. Both guys here just having a good look. I think, I think John personally, I mean, from what I've seen, McKinnon might have hurt his right leg. He, I see some blood on the shin. He might have hurt that right leg a couple of times that he's thrown. And around two. IWKBF heavyweight title on the line. Steve McKinnon, Chris Bradford. Kidden peppering away with the low kicks to the lead leg of Bradford. Chris Bradford here coming on. Once again showing good strong handiwork. The fight going to another level now. Of intensity, work. Nice low kick there by McKinnon. That's what he's got to do. He's got to do what he does best. You know, work those big kicks. Look, see, low kick there. It's a bit uncomfortable, it's okay. Nice Bradford. right hand there by Bradford, but uh, McKinnon comes back with a low kick of his own. Yeah, clean right hand straight through the guard of McKinnon. Yeah. Keeping an eye on... Uh, Steve McKinnon, Stan, he's not really kicking with that right leg. I said that, I, I picked it up earlier, I mean. Yep. Looks like he's come in with an injury there because he's got that uh, he's got, he's extended got the sponge. Yeah, yeah, the sponge the, yeah, and the sh oh, it's a shin guard rather than an ankle guard. Yeah, it is a bit of a shin guard. Once again, a big right hand from Bradford. Left, right, kick from McKinnon. Nice, tidy combination. Bradford not being wasteful at all, Stan. Really looking to pick his shots. Yeah, he's picking his shots. Uh, I, I'm just looking at him. He's breathing pretty heavy. Gotta be careful to get caught with anything here. He's got to not wait so long and throw something. Oh, there there's a big right hand. There you go. He's clocked McKinnon. Uppercut. Uppercut. Oh. He unloads once again. He's landed oh. flush on the chin of McKinnon. And he got hit with a low blow. Time. Music plays. Oh. He had him in trouble. He had him in trouble. <laughs> well, we saw it perfectly from our commentary position. It was a beautiful right hook. Right on the chin of Steve McKinnon. So referee Mark Cook won't tolerate any more of this. Gave Steve McKinnon a warning there for the low blow. Injury timeout is allowed of up to five minutes if required. So as Perry Cow mentioned, Chris Bradford, he's got five minutes to recover. Time in. switch up round kick from McKinnon he doubles up once again so only kicking off that lead leg Pepper is away the jab you know maybe a little bit fortunate McKinnon because he was tagged and he it was in big trouble and uh, we almost robbed uh, Chris Bradford from the opportunity oh, that big right hand once again big round here wow. for Chris Bradford he's back well here we go Stan a lot of people didn't expect the bout to go 
this far we're up to round number four of five well let me tell you i mean after that last round and landing that big shot on mckinnon surely there must be a lot of belief right now with bradford you know what i mean giving him a lot of confidence you know i'll give him credit his, his defense is good he's keeping his hands up he's checked a lot of shots in fact that's why we both agree that maybe mckinnon hurt that right shin from a great check that uh, bradford gave it yeah, absolutely but uh, chris now exuding confidence he knows that he he can hurt mckinnon he did it there in the third round this is the fourth of five rounds as we approach halfway through this Main event. Nice head kick there by McKinnon. Let's give thanks to Flavors Fruit and Veg and Clark Rocker Accountants for putting on and supporting this fantastic main event. Two heavyweight warriors here in center ring. And nice. Bradford unloads once again just above us. He's looking for that uppercut. He's looking for a home for that uppercut. Oh. Uppercut again! <laughs> oh, <laughs> Bradford! Bradford landing some big shots. McKinnon comes right back with a switch round kick to the head. Missing some punches there, McKinnon. Yeah, Chris does well to stay out of range of the punches from McKinnon. You know, both these guys got to be careful because one shot, one shot at the right place and it's all over. Partic Heavyweights. Particularly in this weight division. You've got 94 kilos behind each punch and kick. And it only takes one. Got grazes him with that right kick there, McKinnon. Oh, nice little move, sneaky move there. Spinning back kick. Oh, to the Bradford come back with big punches. He takes a bit of a knee to the head. He's trying to land that big right hand. Sweat absolutely spraying on us ringside as these two warriors battle it out just above us. Once again, McKinnon working the round kicks, goes to the rib cage, then downstairs. Bradford. Pretty much defensive. When he cuts loose, he throws punches. Shakes his head once again. Smirking at each other there. He's playing a game of tactics here with McKinnon. But the work right here, McKinnon obviously looking like winning the round the way he's going. And Chris just needs to pick up the pace. Again, the work right here by McKinnon is telling. Nice left hook. He's going to throw punches. He's going to throw four, five, six punches. Left rip. Puts up together here, Bradford. Nice round kick there by McKinnon. Oh, big right hand by McKinnon. And we're seeing McKinnon now kicking off that right leg. <laughs> wow. And a round fifth. Four. And final round. Oh, here we go, Stan. Expect fireworks here in the fifth and final round. Steve McKinnon, Chris Bradford. This is for the IWKBF heavyweight title. Chris still smiling, talking to McKinnon, perhaps insulting him. Who knows? <laughs> we don't know what they're saying, but Bradford smiling. And uh, it was McKinnon really landing the better shots there in that exchange. Well, we know that he can't insult him about his age because they're both 40 years of age. I tell you, I tell you, what I'd be doing if I was in the corner of Bradford, I'd be telling him to throw punches. I'm talking about punches in bunches i'm talking about that's his greatest weapon really are his hands right oh, there that left was... hook he's gonna put punches together here five six of them and the there. punches he's landing big shots mckenna comes back with a high kick come on ladies and gentlemen kick. final round it's a battle of the puncher versus the kicker at the moment as the chant goes up for chris bradford chris bradford looks a bit tired High kick by McKinnon again. Bradford's going to put punches together here. Once again, sneaky. McKinnon attempts that spinning back kick to the thigh. That time missing the mark. He's going to throw punches here, Bradford. He's waiting. Left hook, right hand. Nice. Put some punches together. Nice right hand by McKinnon. McKinnon. Come on, punch. Make some noise. Once again, McKinnon goes upstairs, oh, round kick. Oh, there's another right hook He's going to throw punches. Bradford. Smart McKinnon using the jab, round kick. 
See, Brentford, one, two punches, eight. one, two punches. That's all he's doing. He's going to throw six, seven, eight of them. Leading with the uppercut. One minute to go! A minute left here. McKinnon goes upstairs, head hunting with the round kick. Battling through the pain in that shin, kicking off that right leg. Works now to the rib cage, double up, not giving Bradford a chance to move in. Oh, they both look spent at the moment. It looks like something. Oh! oh just a slip there from Chris Bradford as McKinnon attempts. Final the 30 punch. seconds! 30 seconds left here in this main event. Bradford looks tired and spent. He's got to dig in deep and find something right here. He's got to dig in and put some punches together. Final 15 seconds, out. let's bring him He's home! Big right hand misses, left hook, right hand. He's on leg kick by McKinnon. Just a slip once again from Chris, trying to unload. Big bombs from both fighters. Oh, what an absolute Wow, we that's what you call a world heavyweight title. Was that a main event, world title fight or what? Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise. All right, Clark Crocker and Flavors of Fruit and Veg, our main event sponsors. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecard. It is a unanimous decision. <laughs> Nadal Taleb had a 49-46. Charlie Camilleri had a 49-46 and Shane Byrne had a 50-45 for your winner. Blue Corner, the smashing machine, Steve McKinnon. Oh, there you have it, Stan. It was a unanimous points decision going the way of...